A food truck owner shot an armed man who tried to rob the business during the lunch hour in southwest Houston. No one's in custody and police are calling it a self-defense shooting. ABC 13's Micah Hatfield just spoke to the shooter's family and joins us live with more, Micah. Eric, I just spoke to the shooter's son. He says this is devastating to his family. He's very fortunate. He feels very fortunate that his mother and his uncle are still alive. They were the ones inside of this food truck. All of this happened today, and they had only made $40. They open this because the mom knows how to cook, and we just try to make, they just try to make an honest living. You know, everybody ain't trying to make an honest living. These are trying to make an honest living. The Elite Eats food truck had only been open an hour today. Derek Howard, one of the owners, was on his way to help his mother and uncle who were manning the truck. Before he could get there, things turned deadly. Did she keep a gun on her just out of fear that something like this might happen? Correct. Nine days you have to. Look, that's how it's bad. Houston police say around 1 o'clock this afternoon, a 23-year-old man pulled up next to the truck on Main Street near Fondren. He asked Howard's mother and uncle what kind of food they served. When they told him, he pulled out a gun. Howard's uncle shut the window to the food truck. Police say the 23-year-old got out of his car, opened the window, put his gun inside, and fired, but it jammed. Howard's mother pulled out a gun of her own and shot the robber. Thank God, because she's a godly woman, that's why they jammed, that gun jammed, because God jammed it. Because when she opened that window, he could have shot her, but it jammed. The robber, only described as a 23-year-old man, died in the parking lot. Police called this a self-defense shooting. No one is in custody. Howard's mother was taken to the hospital because she had a panic attack. He says all of this was over only $40. That's all they had made today. People need to get a job and stop trying to rob people because some people are trying to make an honest living. In Southwest Houston, Micah Hatfield, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.